Oh, hello. Yes, am I through to Jehovah's Witnesses? I'm on JW.org. Yeah. Oh, hi there. Yeah, um, I've been reading in Joy Life Forever and doing some reading and research on JW.org. I'm trying to understand more. Um, is it possible to help, or are you, if you're busy at the moment, I don't want to disturb you if you're busy. Uh, well, I'm just gardening <coughs> at the moment. Um, uh, can I call you back, or can yes. you call back in... Uh... You call me back when it's convenient. Oh, OK. Um, I can what's Zoom. Name, Pardon? My name is Robert what? Skinner. I can Zoom if you want to speak to me on Zoom. Yeah, Robert what, sorry? Robert Skinner. Did I speak to you before? I've, I've been, yes, I've still been reading the book. I've, I've been at it for quite some time, so, yes. Yeah. I, I, did I speak to you about, um, let's see, um, about the resurrection? Um, yes, the resurrection. That was chapter 15, wasn't it, of Enjoy Life Forever? Yeah, how you couldn't sort of agree with the uh, resurrection as a, in a spirit body, is that right? Well, you have to show me a verse that, that says that in the Bible. I'll happily accept it if you can show me a verse that says that. Right, I remember that, yeah. Well, I did, actually, in uh, Corinthians. You didn't agree with the... Uh... It doesn't say a spirit body. It says plumaticos soma. Plumaticos is spiritual, not spirit. Spirit is pneuma. The word there in 1 Corinthians fifteen forty four is plumaticos. It means spirit dominated or under spirit control. And soma uh, means a physical body. Uh, soma always means a physical body when it's applied to a human being, never a, a body made out of spirit. So it's a human physical body that is plumatic or soma. It's, uh, it's that body is under spiritual control. Um, right, you but, have to be able. The whole chapter is speaking about the resurrection, isn't it? Um, it's talking about the glorification, yes, resurrection and also glorification of the human body at Christ's return for the saints of God, yes. Yeah, so, <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I remember that we didn't didn't come to any uh, agreement on the, uh, well, on the matter. That's okay, I mean, you can let th think things over for a few months, can't, can't you? Isn't that, isn't that a, an intelligent way to... to you know, you people don't make up their decisions immediately. People have to think things over, don't they? Yes. Yeah. Well, it, it has been a few months. <laughs> yeah. Um, I've been looking at your knowledge book, and on page 132, there's a picture of Jehovah in heaven, and it's really strange. It's, it's like those kids' comics where if you fold pages, you get subliminal images that come up. If you fold that page, page 132, and you cut out the middle half of that picture, so you just have the left-hand side, the quarter, and the quarter on the right-hand side, and you put those two quarters together, you get a skull on top of a pyramid. I was shocked. <laughs> There's no subliminal images in our literature. Well, I'm actually looking at it. Okay. I actually got the book, right. and I folded the pages. I, I ruined the book doing it. Well, <clears throat> um... And I, I'm shocked. Uh, yeah. Uh, right, well, uh, I've not heard anyone else who's done that. Yeah. There's a watchtower, 1970... No, sorry, 1st of November, 1989 watchtower, page 10, and it's a picture of a man and a woman outside a cinema. It shows the man and the woman's head, uh, a roll of film, and then the cinema with people outside in the background. When you look on the cinema um, bulletin board to see which film they're actually showing, it's quite, sh it's quite shocking. There's two films. The first is Jest, T-U-P-S, and the second is Through Daily. Well, a jest is a joke, and Through Daily means done on a daily basis. Um, the, the second word, T-U-P-S, doesn't make any sense. But if you put the S on jests and you reverse T-U-P, it, it says jests, meaning jokes, put through daily. Right. That can't be a coincidence, okay, yeah, can I, it? Uh, you, you're trying to read things into uh, <clears throat> our literature that simply isn't there. Uh, anyone can do that with anything. Um, and believe me, it's not there. 
Well, I'm actually looking at it. I'm looking at it on the computer. Oh, okay. I scanned it into the computer. I'm looking at yeah. the yellow um, bulletin board on the front of the cinema. Just t tups, T-U-P-S, through daily. And you put the S onto jests, making it jest jokes. And you reverse T-U-P, and it says jests, meaning jokes, put through daily. It, it's obviously oh, not a coincidence. It's obviously deliberate. Surely... <clears throat> Sorry? Um, it is a coincidence. You, you think that we're just a joke then? That we're, uh, no, I, I said it's not to... a joke. I said it's deliberate. No, but you, you're saying jest through Dale. So you think you're just trying to fool people? Yes, I, I think the Watchtower is trying to fool people. I, I think the oh, Watchtower okay. Society, it has stated in the past that it believes that Lucifer is a god. That's on the book Children on page 55 where it also states that Lucifer oversaw the creation of the earth, so I thought Father, Son and Holy Spirit were the creator of the universe, but when it came to the earth, it was Father, Son, Holy Spirit and Lucifer, according to the Watchtower. That's a Luciferian uh -huh. teaching. That, that's, that's not a Christian teaching. Um, OK, the... right, well, I think, as, uh, as I said last time we spoke, um, you, you've already made your mind up what you want to believe, and you're simply looking for faults. Well, I'm actually quoting uh, evidence, I'm giving you references. Um, so, th there's no point in uh, continuing one, the conversation. One final thing, you have two editions of your book, Sing to Jehovah, which was released in 2008. On the back cover, uh, you have a picture of various people praising, um, and you have a black man and a black woman in the bottom left-hand corner in the first edition. Now, what's in front of the black man is not a hand or an arm. Following complaints, the black man's picture, the black man was removed and replaced with a white man. And, you, and in the revised 2009 edition of Sing for Jehovah, or it's either Sing to Jehovah or Sing for Jehovah. Um, you can see that the white man has replaced the black man and the black thing in front of the black man has been removed, whatever it is, and um, a white man's arm and hand has been inserted there. Why the change in that songbook? Yeah, well, like I said, you're just looking for faults. And uh, if you want to find faults in anything... You can do, whether they're there or not. You can do that with absolutely anything. Um, so I, I don't want to continue the conversation. I'm sorry. So I mean, I've given you I'll references. Say, I will say, I will say goodbye. <laughs> but I've given you references. You could look this up and get yeah, back right, to me. Yeah. Give me okay. specific answers to the points right. that I've raised. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye.